Let's talk a little bit about uh, what our options should be in terms of how we should dress <laughs> and how much water we should drink yes, and all yeah. of that. Oh, yeah. Shorts, tank tops, flip flops, a nice sun hat, and uh, lots of water. Not just fun drinks, but water too. Yeah. <laughs> we'll be helpful. We are going to heat up as we head our way throughout uh, the weekend here. Portland Pride Festival. Uh, again, events kick off at noon tomorrow, but you can find a lot going on uh, starting tonight. Sunday is the parade. Notice these temperatures. Very hot here around the area. Yeah, likely in the mid 90s by tomorrow and uh, we will see temperatures likely still around the upper 80s to about 90 degrees on Sunday around the Portland metro area. So be aware of the heat and make sure you've got ways to cool off or take breaks from the heat if you'll be out and about this weekend. As we start this morning back under sunshine, a beautiful start there out of Kalama from the McMinimins Kalama Harbor Lodge camera. Love seeing those vessels there out on the river just chugging on by here. Here, but we are seeing clear conditions and sunshine already starting out this morning. Mid 60s too in Portland, which is a very warm start here uh, for morning time. So you likely won't need a jacket today. It's going to be very comfortable this morning and mild and uh, we'll see temperatures climbing fast as we head towards about 10 o'clock already in the 70s. So here's a look around Portland. A lot of areas back in the upper 50s to mid 60s here, low 60s up to Vancouver. So enjoy your start. Great for a bike ride into work, maybe some early morning exercise. If you want to avoid the heat right now is a great time. Uh, to get outside uh, and across our morning because it's afternoon we heat right up as we head towards uh, the afternoon hours, maybe around uh, two o'clock and beyond. We could be in the 90s. So temperatures around Tiger Beaverton, Lake Oswego, low 90s today. Uh, that summertime sizzle out there. Portland expecting highs around 92 as well. There could be some cities around uh, the Portland metro area that touch maybe 93 or uh, 94 degrees. Just a lot of heat going into today. Same for up in Clark County. County. That's summer sunshine and temperatures also breaking the 90s today. And the reason for it is this ridge of high pressure. It's building. I'm sure you've heard of all of that heat expected around the West Coast areas of California, more inland across the uh, the uh, Great Basin, the desert Southwest temperatures climbing and have been sitting in the triple digits. So concerning temperatures for a lot of states around this region, Portland will also tap into this heat too, where temperatures are likely to stay in the 90s all weekend long long starting with today. So our very dry and sunny pattern uh, continuing for us as this high pressure starts to shift out the door uh, going into next week. We're still under a pretty uh, prominent summer pattern here staying warm and dry. I don't really see much change or temperatures may drop a bit mainly staying in the 80s next week and Monday will likely be our coolest day uh, of the next handful. So we get a bit of a break here come Monday, but Take a look at forecast temperatures. Winds will play a big role in how warm we get. Right now we're seeing winds mainly out of the north uh, that will help temperatures creep into the 90s as we head our way into uh, this afternoon. Now as we go into Saturday, that'll be our hottest day of this stretch where a lot of spots around Portland will likely hit uh, the mid 90s. Some spots could even be closer to the upper 90s. Then we get to Sunday and we start to increase those northwesterly winds here. So we should cool off a bit, likely upper 80s to around 90 degrees by Sunday. We're starting to cool off, but it's on Monday. We really increase those onshore winds, winds coming in from the west and onshore from the ocean. So the temperatures will fall a bit, maybe the upper 70s to uh, low 80s come Monday. So there will be a brief cool down as we head into early next week. Here's that temperature trend once again, uh, likely in the 90s for the next three days, then a bit cooler come Monday. But take a look Tuesday and beyond next week. We're right back in the 80s. So the summertime pattern and heat can continue uh, around Portland here. So expect to see more summer sunshine again this weekend for Pride Fest. Any events around town, we will see hot temperatures in Portland as we stay in the 90s all weekend long.